we are got the, the camper here in the driveway. It probably looks like Christmas vacation. I know our neighbors, they can't like me because I live here at my parents' house and like there's always like five or six cars here and I've always got like a trailer or some sort of something out here going on and they're just probably like, oh my God. But we have this camper here right now. I'm about to take it over to my buddy Cameron's house and uh, y'all know Cameron at this point. So we're gonna go over there and finish up the one spot in the floor and uh, pretty much button it up and then it'll be ready. Skirting, it'll be something we have to do, but let's go, uh, let's get on the road. Just... What you doing, Zeke? Cameron's now, forgot to bring the camera just a second ago. We ran it to the shop in his car because we're parked at his house. We've got the piece of wood in here, so that's starting to look a little bit better. Hopefully, uh, we're about to get this zipped up. We get our, our coat rack on here. It might be a little dark right now. And uh, we're gonna get, uh, get a couple more things done. Let's check out, let's check out this saw in this shop. All right, we're here in the wood shop. We're working on it. We just about got it done. It's gonna look pretty good. Man, big shout out to Cameron. Thank him so much. I thank him so much. And they've been so helpful. This actually looks fire to me. It did look way worse. It's still like, this is makeshift. It's half hazard, but now it's like, we got some brown in here. Courtesy of our friend Caitlin Soykang. We have this in Marshall. We'll leave him out. We have this nice sign, which is like really cool. It's like an actual street sign. Was an actual street sign. and. We got some brown in here and like that looks like Cameron really hooked this up. He made it look super good. So now that's pretty much, uh, we're gonna do a couple little things, hang a shelf and stuff, but everything now is like running screws in, super cosmetic. That was like the last like actual like carpentry thing we had to do. And Cameron really hooked that up. He did a much better job than I would have done. So I'm super happy that looks the way it does. We have a little spot for our boots. And now this place is, it's nothing fancy. We didn't like, we didn't do anything crazy or do like a true like remodel, but now it's just way more functional. We have like a whole open area in here. We had six people in here the other day. I mean, it's small. There's no getting around that, but at least now everybody was able to sit down in here. We, nobody was like touching shoulders or like stepping on each other completely. We were all able to sit down and like eat a plate of food and then like get out, but it's still nice that we have the ability to do so. and. It looks a little bit better. I know Emily's super happy about that. And so am I. So we're about to eat some pizza. And five days till departure. Christmas Eve is tomorrow. We got a whole bunch earlier in the day. It was all like banking stuff and trying to just get all my uh, affairs in order, I guess I would say. All right. My parents just left. I had a ton of stuff to do. Our friend, it's 1040 now. Our friends Caitlin and Marshall are coming over. Caitlin was like in the tail end of one of the last videos, so they're gonna come and hang out. I'm definitely gonna say hi when they're here this time. I've been talking about that forever. But uh make dinner with my parents. We finally got the camera almost done. It's like I would say like 95% of the way like that we wanted to kind of get it set up for this upcoming trip to Brick. And uh let's just check it out. Feels like a home in here. What do you think, Bruce? You comfortable, man. You think Bruce is comfortable? Gracie's comfortable. There's no doubt about it. She's down there nice pillow. She likes. She's comfortable. Emily. She's just complaining all the time. All right. Whole gang's here now. Bruce is. Bruce is getting pampered unnecessarily. <laughs> That's out of control. Marshall and Caitlin, which we mentioned earlier. Caitlin was the one, like I said earlier, from the last video. Very end. Mm -hmm. Nobody playing that nice here. Yeah. <laughs> We're kicking it. If you're wondering, 
four people, two dogs, in the front of a 25 foot Airstream comfortably. It's definitely possible. It's not too small, in my opinion. But, <laughs> we'll catch y'all tomorrow.